Hi, and welcome to Spook Show Gaming. My name is Spooky, and today we're going to be playing Demon Souls. I've been wanting to do this for a while now, um, but I'm, I'm really excited to be starting a new character. I have beat this game before, um, but it has been, I don't know, it's been a while. It's been about a year and a half. So, let's go ahead and get started. Alright, thank you guys for joining me for another video on my channel. I really appreciate it a lot. As you guys know. But um, I'm really excited to, to be starting this again. So, <clears throat> here we go. Where they started it all. <laughs> That was badass opening. Badass. Press the start button. Well, don't mind if I do. I'm going to be starting a new game. So glad that they're online mode. Their servers are still up. <laughs> I know a while back they were. They had um, thought about cutting off the servers. We're gonna be spooky. That's me. All right. <clears throat> yes, changing gender settings will cause edited appearance data to be lost. All right. So class. I you know I've thought about this a little bit and I'm not sure what class I want to be. Um. I usually. In these games, I like be it to be able to have a high dexterity, or high-ish dexterity, be able to use a good, uh, like, light sword, like a short sword, or a scimitar, or something of the sort. So, I'm thinking I could do magician, you know, or wanderer, let's see, the magic of wanderer is nine. Hmm, I could always do barbarian. Oh, that's sexy right there. See, thief. Hmm. Temple Knight. You know what? I think I'm going to do royalty. 
think I'm gonna do royalty. Yep, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna kinda make character real quick. Let's do random. Nope. Wow, some of these faces are just so attractive. I know. I'm going all fashion souls. Hardcore. Ew. Ew. No, that last one wasn't too bad, but... Nope, they're all bad. I look, I'm, I look more and more like a man every time I hit random. <laughs> man. 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 Look scared. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, you better be scared. And that looks manly, but I guess we could deal with that. We're gonna be... Look more female than we do male. Alright. Ponytail. Chignan. Chig oh, like a... Okay. Oh, wow. Shaved. Nope. Buzz cut. Short wavy. Long, yeah, let's do long wavy. And I'm gonna. Oh, look, that's an ugly color. Look at that. Let's do details. I'm just gonna change my hair color. Make it something funky. Like purple. Yeah, that works. Alright, I think that works. And here we go. Hold on, let me see. Head appearance, yeah, okay. Like I said, it's been a while since I played this game, so I gotta get back into the groove of things. Excuse me. It's gonna take a little while. You guys ever seen uh let's see what was the name of it? <laughs> I don't know, it was a movie when I was a kid. Uh Fern Gully. It was a cartoon. It's about these uh this fairy and trying to like protect the forests and stuff. It was getting chopped down by uh this um I guess they were clearing it out anyway. It's the first time I ever heard of the word Nexus. <laughs> that uh I don't know what it was. It was like the evil within the thing it was called the Nexus. That was destroying the magical forest. Every time I hear Nexus, that's what I think of. <laughs> but, yeah. That's me.
Would I like to play the journey to the Nexus? Yes. I'm gonna try and fight the, uh, the Grey Demon. I believe with the royalty you start out with, uh, magic. So that should help us. So let's see here. We got Solero. One of the things I do like about this uh, versus in the Dark Souls or Dark Souls 2, your magic is just based on how much, um, I'm just going to call it mana, how much mana you have. So it's not like you have five left or ten left. You just have as much that you can cast until your mana depletes and then you have to, um, you have to use an herb or forget what it is in this one that brings it back. Alright. Like I said, I gotta get, oh crap. I gotta get back in the hang of things. Alright, so it looks like I've started with a rapier of some sort. Let's see. I've started with yeah, rapier. The silver catalyst. What's cool is um, um I automatically start out with the silver coronet, which re um slowly regenerates your magic. So That'll, um, that's actually something you can't get until later on in the game unless you start out being uh, royalty. Which I am. So. So weird. You know, you go from Dark Souls 2 to this and it's like, whoa, this is, you know, this is weird. It's just not as, uh, not as fluid, you know? I mean, like, it's not bad by any means. It's just not as, uh, fluid. Let's see. Stab, 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 poke, poke, poke. Thank you, sir. Like I said, I don't really remember. I mean, I remember. God, I remember when I first played this game. Um, and I've heard a lot of people say this, but when I first played this game, I hated it. Like, it was, it was rough. I mean, I didn't hate it, but it was. It was definitely different, and I was so aggravated. I got so mad at it because I'd never played a game that was as hard as this one. So I was really like, oh my god, you know? I was really overwhelmed. But uh, I, I put it down for the longest time. I didn't play it actually until I played Dark Souls. And then I was like, oh, Demon Souls. So I went back and, uh, and played this afterwards. I was like, man, why... Man, dude, seriously. I was like, what, man, why, why, you know, why didn't I do this to start with? Because this game is awesome. All of, all three of the games are awesome. And I'm, I'm really excited for, uh, I don't really know much about it, but I am excited for, for Bloodborne. I know it's not a Dark Souls uh, 3, but to me, I, well, from what I've seen of it, it looks more like a Demon Souls, in my opinion. But I'm excited for that. But, uh,. But yeah, so when I first played this game, like I said, it was it was rough. I, I really didn't care much for it. And the first level, 1-1, one, one, the, let's see, I'm looking around here. What's this here? Okay. The, um, bu uh, bu bu I believe it's called Bulletarian Palace. Oh, there you are. Um, I did that level probably, I don't know, 30 or so times maybe more <laughs> to uh add to finally get it so it it took me a long time to do it i had it to the point where i had memorized where every single thing was and it was just it was crazy but you know the repetition helped me in a way because it helped me learn where everything was 
and and uh, whatnot. So, oh, too early, too early. I'm trying to do this thing where I can actually think and play and talk at the same time. I'm getting better at it, I think, but it will take me a little bit of time. All right, come on, Perry. Too early. Too early again. Damn. You suck. Die. Oh, I had just enough stamina to do that, too. Let's see. Let's have my... Yeah, crescent and grass. Oh, and I remembered what it takes... Oh, hello, dude. I remember what it takes to uh, restore your um, magic now. And it's uh, spice. Old spice and fresh spice. Not, you know, like the Spice Girls. Posh Spice. Anyway. <laughs> yes, I know. I'm lame, guys. It's cool. Put that shield down, dude. Really? They, these guys look cool. They, they, I mean, the, the, as far as the glowing, glowing eyes and such. Alright, I don't really remember too much about this. Half moon grass. I was gonna try, try to defeat the uh, the gray demon because I th I'm thinking with his soul. I don't know something to do with his soul. I don't. Oh shit! Walked into that one literally. Oh yeah. Um, you can trade the gray demon soul to Sparkly for something that I can't remember right now. <laughs> But that's that's why um, why I want it. Nothing back here. What's up, dude? I'm too early on my parries. Gotta take so many jabs to kill these guys. Oh, I love that soul arrow though. That's that's pretty boss. It's pretty OP. More crescent moon grass. Cool. I need to heal anyway. Thinking, is there something over there? I don't remember if there is or not. Nope. If I miss something, guys, I'm real sorry. But I'm a. Uh, like I said, it's been a while since I played this. So. Trying to get back into the groove of things. It is. I mean, obviously, it's the same type of uh, game as Dark Souls and. Dark Souls 2, but it's still very, very different in other ways. I guess I could run. I don't know. I, I like taking my time. I don't like missing anything. Alright, is this for the demon? Yeah, it is. Okay, so we're going to try to defeat this guy, but I'm not really, I'm not really sure if uh, that's going to happen. But we're going to try. Vanguard. Oh my god, never mind. <laughs> god, I I don't know. I, I was trying to roll but those those uh columns I mean I obviously you're not supposed to I mean, you don't have to defeat him. But I I, I typically try to. The last time I did it um did it pretty good. I mean, I, I, I did it with a uh, soul arrow, but you gotta be really good at rolling. I mean, dodging. I'm sorry. Here we are, the Nexus. This place looks so cool. And the Maiden in Black.
Alright, you have died and the Nexus has trapped your soul. You cannot escape the Nexus. So pretty much she was like, Oh hey, you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna rescue you, but you can't leave. Okay. Next seal binding. Let's see where that's at. We can go ahead and read that to you guys. Do 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 it's not an actual ring, it's a uh, user that loses souls and is returned to Nexus. So that's like the uh, the dark side and dark souls and dark souls too. Wow, it took half my health. I haven't really, it hasn't really sunk in yet. How uh, little that is. But, um, alrighty, so we're gonna go and enter the first, uh, 1 1, and then we're gonna go talk to the main in black and the monumental. So, we're gonna be starting Voltaire Palace in, um, in the next episode. And we'll be going through, uh, it says, a huge stone castle in the heart of the northern kingdom of Boletaria. Hungry soldiers whose souls have been stolen by demons attack trespassers. And terrible dragons nest there. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. And I hope you guys will join me again for the second part when we go through Boletarian Palace. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. I appreciate it a ton. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.